Uh, why is the telephone expense an expense? Telephone expense is an expense for Patrick's plumbing because it will cause a decrease in the asset bank. Be careful about that. If it says telephone paid on credit, you would also you wouldn't be saying an increase in the asset bank. You would say a increase. Sorry, you wouldn't say a decrease in the asset bank. You would say a increase in the current liability, which is accounts payable um, when Patrick pays a bill with money from the bank. This causes a decrease in profit and a decrease in equity, and is not drawings by Patrick. Notice how they've used the uh, drawings by Patrick as opposed to drawings by the owner. The recognition criteria, uh, it is probable that the asset will decrease when Patrick pays the telephone expense. So they've uh, looked at the probability element and Patrick can, uh, is it measured with reliability. Patrick can prove he has paid the telephone bill as, a, as an invoice to prove that he has paid $4,000. Be careful, you wouldn't have an invoice to say you've paid $4,000, you'd probably have a receipt to say you've paid $4,000. Um, so other than that, but they've got the three part definition. Decrease in assets, uh, causing a, a decrease in profitability and an increase in equity. Decrease in equity, not a contribution, distribution to the owner and they've got the two-part recognition criteria. It's, it's a very strong answer. The only thing I'd be wor worried about is the, uh, it will have an invoice as proof that he has paid. You would have a receipt to say as proof that he's paid. 4.2. The purchase of new office furniture is a capital expense for Patrick's Plumbing. This is because the purchase is a one-off type spending that is creating a non-current asset which will generate future economic benefit for more than one accounting period. So we're talking about a capital expenditure which is the aim is you create a non-current asset which will last longer. They've related to the office furniture of Patrick's Plumbing. It's not a one-off expense and it's going to last longer than one accounting period. It's a beautiful answer, 4.2. One more, 4.3. Ah, the expense of telephone is classified as a revenue expense. This is because it's an ongoing expense. The entity as the telephone expense must be paid monthly. Isn't the creation of a non-current asset in the day-to-day -day operation of the entity? So if you, look, if you compare 4.2 and 4.3, they use the same definition but alternated. So where 4.3 says, um, it's the purchase of a one-off item. 4.2 said the purchase of a one-off item. 4.3 says the purchase of a ongoing expense. Uh, and where 4.2 said uh, it will purchase a non-current asset, 4.3 says it won't purchase a non-current asset. So you can use the same general ideas in both, you just change them. But other than that, this is a great answer.